being a, a science teacher and really trying to get students to really enjoy science and see the fun that's in it, I'm so proud. <laughs> oh my God, look at this. That is so dope. George to the Rescue has really helped rescue us. <laughs> it just took me and blew me away. Hi, I'm Medina. And hi, I'm Tariq. And we're the Eatman family. And I'm the owner of Science Teacher Mom. We live in New Jersey, and we have two sons, Issa and Bilal. <laughs> so on a day-to-day -day basis, it is very busy. My son does virtual school, and I teach virtually. Good morning, good morning. We're going to get started in a couple minutes. Oh, this is very much so a real science household. I mean, every day when I walk in, I'm walking into some level of an experiment. Go! Isa, he's my four-year-old son. He's the oldest, and he is brilliant. <laughs> he's very, very loving. He'll come and give hugs, like say hi, and he loves to learn. So he was the one who got me into teaching at home. And then my two-year-old, Bilal, he is a fireball of energy. He wants to play, and he wants to do everything that his brother does. As the father of four kids who have been trying to learn from home for this past year, my appreciation for those educators who inspire them has never been higher. And when I was in school, science was my favorite subject. So I couldn't be more excited to be spotlighting someone who shares that passion and enthusiasm for science. STEM means science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Science and the STEM careers in general are so important because it allows for children, students, parents, everyone to think critically because we're given so much information, especially now with the internet, we're given so much, but we need to be able to teach these tools so that they grow up to become these citizens using critical thinking skills to make the decisions going forward. I love what Medina is doing. Like all great scientific minds, she is embracing experimentation and she has discovered new ways to reach her students and their families during this pandemic. Her exciting home-based startup, Science Teacher Mom, is absolutely booming. So when the pandemic started, we started making STEM kits for children. Um, it started as a hobby with just my nieces and nephews, and now it's just been growing. At this point, we've created a science subscription box for teachers and homeschooling parents that consists of four weeks of lessons, the lesson plans, the worksheets, and the videos for the teachers and students to use. Once you open a box, you open an experience. It's not just items. You get an entire opportunity to really come down this road of going into her mind to see weather, to see uh, the space. You welcome an, an entire experience for you and your children. I learn when I open a box, <laughs> that's for sure. We go up to about 200 boxes per month, um, so we should be over about 1,000 boxes since we started. I'm very proud of my wife. I'm not very surprised at the responses because I knew once the world was able to see what I see every day, they were gonna jump to whatever it is that she puts forward into the world. I know my wife and I met my wife as a world traveler, but in this pandemic, she can't go as many places. So she's taken that into science and traveled in a virtual sense all over the planet by using these boxes now. And so now, although she can't physically get there, she can live through the students who live in those locations. When we first started, we needed more space, and so we went through the process of trying to uh, fix up our basement. It was not in very good shape at all. Right now, there are boxes everywhere. We use a couple of tables that we borrowed that usually used for parties, and we use the floor space a lot to package the materials. George the Rescue coming to help, it would dovetail and kind of connect to the story of Science Teacher Mom starting uh, to servicing, to being able to grow and actually give more life to more people all across the globe. George, we would love if you were able to come and help us to inspire the next generation of children, your children, my children. That's, that's what we got for this earth. That's next. <laughs> hey. hey! Excellent! Wow! <laughs> Hello! I know you got a basement that you use a little love. Absolutely. So, <laughs> Pete Alvon will turn that on its head and hopefully uh, many things can blossom from it. Man, that, that would be great. absolutely amazing. Thanks Thank a lot, George. Oh. Us parents, we gotta stick together, man. We gotta stick together. <laughs> we gotta stick together. <laughs> what a phenomenal family. They really made the most of a very challenging year and I am excited to take their efforts and their space to the next level. George to the Rescue is sponsored in part by Scotch Painters Tape. For more info, go to scotchbrand.com slash painters tape.
We are kicking off a new project, and we are kicking it off with a new designer. This is Courtney's first time on George to Rescue, but this lady, she knows what she's doing. When I got the call from George to be on the show, I was absolutely tickled pink. We have a lot to do over a really tight time frame, but you know, I like a challenge at the end of the day. Actually, the basement is in really good shape. Just looking around, you can see that, it, yeah, I mean, this is like a beautiful blank canvas. I've seen pretty much everything you can see. Can of worms, they don't scare me. This basement is perfect. Literally like the cleanest basement I've ever seen. It's one, one spider web and it's not even like, it's like not, it's like one spindle. So really these sort of three structure columns yep. in the center is what we really use to help us to delineate space and define use. It's almost like, yeah, since it's here, it can't it's go here. anywhere. We exactly. may as well make it part of the family. Let's take advantage of it. We are going to give Medina a place where she can do all of her lectures, all of her class lessons. We are going to figure out a space that we can you know, create all the labs. Everything's gonna be organized. So we're in full on paint mode. We got the guys from Michael J Design here, literally tackling every surface in here, walls. And then we're gonna hit all of these rails on the stairs. But first things first, in order for the new paint to adhere to this, we gotta knock it down, which means we gotta take the sheen off. Not a tough job, actually a perfect job for 3M sanding sponges. Nice thing about these sanding sponges, they got this channeling right here. So as I sand, the dust isn't billowing around, it's all just channeling right down here. What's going on here? I know what pegboard is, but how's, how's it all being utilized? Yeah, you know, this is a really small space and a lot of work has to get done. So we knew we had to maximize every inch. We thought pegboards are cool, but we need to sort of take it up a notch design-wise. Of course, Courtney's not gonna let us just put up pegboards. We had to make sure that they went with the color scheme for the rest of the basement. The color scheme that we got from Medina's logo. So we want super sharp paint lines. We want that edge lock protection. We are going with 3M Scotch Blue Ultra Sharp Paint Lines. Those lines are sharp, sharp, sharp. One of the coolest high-tech elements that we are putting into this basement is a vibe board. And the people at Viborg sent this to us when they heard what we were doing for Medina, who Medina was. Viborg's gonna help Medina broadcast to students literally across the globe. Hey, hey, look at that, it's Leo. Hey, Leo, Leo, what are you up to? Nothing, I'm just in backyard. Nice, nice. Well, we uh, are headed over to the Liberty Science Center. I was wondering, you wanna join me? I know you're like the scientist in the family. Yeah, I really, really, really wanna come. Awesome, awesome. Tell mom to put out my khakis. Okay, I, I want to change. We're better to bring you guys than the Liberty Science Center. Have you ever fed a butterfly before? Wow. 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 Yeah. <laughs> George to the Rescue is sponsored in part by 3M. For more information, go to 3MDIY.com. Hey, I'm George Oliphant, host of George to the Rescue. With summer here, it is time to change your filters. You want to change your one inch filters every three months, six to 12 months for larger filters. Caring for your home starts with caring for the air inside. For more info, visit filtry.com. to bring you guys then the Liberty Science Center. We got my friend Fred here. He's our tour hey, guy. Fred. And I actually Great brought to meet you guys. My son, Leo, Leo. He's a scientist in my family. My son, Leo, is going to be a scientist. He tells everyone it's his favorite subject. So when he heard I was taking the Eatman family to the Liberty Science Center, he's like, Dad, you got somebody else joining you on the rescue. Those are piranha. Have you ever heard of piranha? Pufferfish. Oh, it looks like a pufferfish. Hey, he's looking at you, man. <laughs> We're so excited to take it all in. There's so much to see here. Being a, a science teacher and really trying to get students to really enjoy science and see the fun that's in it, this place is phenomenal for that. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Too scary. 
This is our boa constrictor from South America. So snakes like this can get to be 12 feet long. She's sticking her tongue out, right? Yes. That's how she senses the world around her. <laughs> you want to touch it? They're not scared. Really dry, oh, right? Yeah, cool? Leo, get in there. You could do that. I'm even going to do it, and I am definitely scared of snakes. <laughs> We got a chance to see some live animals, so we're gonna go take a look at an extinct one. This They're is no our model of a woolly mammoth. Manny the mammoth. Manny. And it's life size, that's how big they were. Wow. Really? Sheesh. Yeah. So geneticists are working right now to see if they can take the DNA and potentially one day bring back mammoths. Like straight out of Jurassic Park oh, style. Oh, pretty <laughs> much real <laughs> Jurassic Park. Wow. Hopefully it goes better. Yeah. Have you ever fed a butterfly before? Never. We're going to feed our butterflies using our special butterfly juice. So you're gonna take your Q-tip and you're gonna dip, Ready to dip one half of it in there. Dip it in. Come from their front. Don't try and come from behind. Butterflies are really important because they help pollinate plants. Yeah, that's for you, bud. I made that, it's a breakfast smoothie. You're gonna love it. All right, everybody, you guys ready to go to outer space? Yeah! yeah. Let's go to outer space! The only planet you can really see in the evening sky right now is the planet Mars. Oh, look at Mars. Going out of space without leaving New Jersey is fabulous, especially for my four-year-old who loves space. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. It was very, very exciting to bring the boys to Liberty Science Center to take them to all of these things that they do at home within the science packs, but then to see it in life form and life size was absolutely awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you it was very so much. fun. <laughs> this was absolutely awesome. Spending this time with Medina and the whole family and just seeing them light up around all of the science exhibits makes me even more excited to get back to her basement so that we can finish everything up so that she can continue to bring the joy of science to communities and kids around the world. Plus, I am bringing in a very special surprise. I got some partners, we're working things out. Let's just call it the ultimate cherry on top for this very deserving educator. <laughs> no, please, thank you. You deserve it. Oh, wow, thank you so, no. so much. 3M's WorkTunes Connect with Bluetooth technology combines a comfortable design with high fidelity sound quality. Help protect your hearing on noisy job sites while streaming your favorite tunes. Make and take phone calls without missing a beat. No cords, no hassle. Be connected. The Moss Boss is here. What's up, Aj? How are you? How are you? We have the Moss Boss working with us today. He created these incredible custom art boxes. And so we created boxes that resemble the periodic table. Are we following like how they are on the periodical table? Or I are we think just we're gonna, a little creative? I think we're gonna just let it flow. How do they do that? So my name's Ajay. I'm the owner of Moss Boss NYC. Each piece is handmade, so we build the frames. We stain them, we seal them. Each moss piece is almost like a puzzle. Because it's an organic element, it has different shapes. We're hanging these boxes with 3M's strongest adhesive. Use Scotch double-sided extreme mounting tape. It can hold up to 30 pounds. So this is how you get to know somebody on George Rescue, yeah? <laughs> 60 seconds of standing here together. So I wanted the basement to accomplish two goals. Number one, to be a really efficient workplace for Medina. And number two, a fantastical, colorful, happy place for the science teacher mom to work and to create for all of her students. Courtney, let's give it a dry run. Let's do the Courtney George box. What do you Sounds say? Sounds good. All right, so we got the box here. <laughs> yep, so what first are we gonna put thing, in ours? the cool crinkle paper. And then I think we should put in one of the slime balls. Oh, hey, this is our, this is, this is our box. We, we, we call the shots. We're going with the galaxy slime. I really kind of want one for myself. If you've ever opened up one of Medina's science kits, you know there are so many different elements that go into it. Each box has four different projects inside of it, if not more. I am creating a tornado right now out of the science teacher mom's kit. I think I can pull this one off. You have two soda bottles and you have what's called the vortex connector, which is a plastic thing that connects the two bottles. The idea is you fill one of the bottles with water three quarters of the way. Then you connect the vortex connector. Bottle number two, screw it on. 
So the last step is we are going to flip it. This will become the top, this will become the bottom, and we'll go clockwise and thus create a tornado. Tornado in a bottle, here we come. Three, two, one. There, 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 there it is. Look at that! Tornado! I've created a tornado. Being a part of George the Rescue was such a gratifying and fun and wonderful experience. And I would do it all over again in a second. Doing something really cool for someone so amazing like Medina and her science teacher mom business, it's, it's a reward in itself. And I'm really happy with how it turned out. And yeah, I feel, feel really proud. What do you say, you wanna see it? Let's make it I'm happen. Excited. Oh my God, look at this. That is so dope. <laughs> <laughs> wow, oh my gosh. These holes are common in houses, easy fix, five inches or smaller. The large hole repair kit can take care of it. It's got a nice repair plate with double-sided tape. It gives you a surface to spread all the compound onto. Fill it up, wipe it clean so you get it nice and smooth. Then you're gonna let it sit for about 24 hours. Sand it down with your sanding sponge that's included in the large hole repair kit. Prime, then paint it. Hole disappears. What's up, guys? Good hey, to see you. Hey, George. Science is why we came, right? I mean, you are doing this for so many families. You are making such a difference. You are making science fun and interesting and exciting. We just wanted to help you take that to the next level. So, Thank you. Uh, what do you say? You want to see it? Let's make I'm it happen. Excited. Boys, yes, let's do it. You guys ready to go see the basement? Are you ready for the family? Oh, yeah. Come on, yeah. Isa. You ready? <laughs> Science! Oh my oh. God, look at the stairs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, man. Oh my God, look at this. That is so dope. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh my God. <laughs> This is not the same space. <laughs> Do you see that? Well, the first moments walking down into the basement, I noticed that the color change was different. So the purple, one of my favorite colors. There was carpeting on the floor, so it seemed warm and cozy. This is Don't everything. Cry. Don't cry. <laughs> Don't cry. <laughs> this is everything. Oh my gosh. To see the color scheme that matched the logo, it just brought life. And it made it really feel like it was an atmosphere where she can continue to create for not just the boys, but for the entire world. This is what yeah. I imagined, but I had no idea on how to do it. <laughs> I oh love this periodic God. table. Look at this, yes. I'm this like, is... what? What the Moss Boss created with the periodic table was the second thing I noticed, and that is just phenomenal. That'll be so engaging and inspiring for my students to see. They'll love it, they'll be asking questions, and just a little bit more engaging, which is really cool. Oh my God, yeah, look, this... and they gave us direct instructions. Oh, you, you nailed it! <laughs> yes! That is so cool. Oh my gosh. You and a TV. Yeah. No, not a TV. Oh, uh, it's a, oh, a full-on no. vibe board. Cool. <laughs> 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 That's cool. Oh man. So seeing a vibe board was that was the first thing that really I mean it just took me and blew me away. Oh, my hand, my handwriting's pretty terrible, but that's alright, yeah. <laughs> this is beautiful, George. You can watch, you you can watch a little George there, there you, you go. Want. We're gonna uh, keep that on the run. Oh, and Zoom is on it? Zoom's wow. already built in, YouTube's already built so in. So I can I know teach from here. <laughs> yeah, we got And the crew shirts. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you can come in. Oh, nice. You're live, I love it. Hi. That is so cute. You all cute. thought of everything. <laughs> yeah. This is, this is something really magnificent, like man. I was just happy with like, tables and. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> well, I, for what you were making do with, I felt this could be so much more. Are you all ready? to do some real science. <laughs> We're gonna do some yeah. science. Yeah. I'm so proud <laughs> of Science Teacher Mom and where we've gotten, starting with just four or five boxes and then now being able to really help a lot more children become involved and engaged in science. And George to the Rescue has really helped rescue us. <laughs> Man, we couldn't thank you all enough. Yeah. No, please. This is uh, this is truly something else. I'm glad you guys love this. Uh, it's because of what you do that we came down here and to help you continue to do it and make it bigger and better. And so we really wanted to do something for you and for your students when you got back to school. So uh, hold on one sec. How are you oh, gosh. Guys? 
What more could there be? Know, what man. more could there be? 3M, through their partnership with Donors Choose, is donating $15,000 for you to start your own STEM program at your oh school. God. This is for you. At that moment, I had no idea what George was about to do when he pulled out that check. I actually couldn't even imagine what he had. I thought it might have been another poster, another, maybe a picture of George that we can hang up down there. Nothing comes free. They know it takes money to get these things started. And I know that so many students are going to be loving science and changing the world because of you. So wow. this is for you to start your own oh STEM program. I was floored. I was overwhelmed with joy to know that the work that is happening isn't for naught and I feel seen and that my students will be seen, especially in the neighborhood that I work in. It's super important that they get access to the best of what we can offer. Through Donors Choose, 3M supports thousands of teacher STEM projects across the country. And we are absolutely thrilled that we can continue to support Medina and the students at Mott Hall 5 in Bronx, New York. <laughs> no, please, thank you. You deserve it. <laughs> She'll really be able to help a no. lot of students. She's going to educate so many people. I mean, absolutely. that's what it's all about. George to the Rescue coming to really help amplify what Science Teacher Mom had been doing. I mean, it's just a living testimony to what we can do when we have collective uh, communities working together. I know, is there better words than thank you, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, George, thank you, Courtney, thank you, Jenny. This was really, truly amazing and a humbling experience for us. Lovely, you guys are wrap. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching that video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to our channel so you never miss a video.